Set your calendars as we now have an official invite for the OnePlus 6T. Some users of the Apple Watch Series 4 are having problems with daylight saving time ending, and the Google Pixel 3 XL is on sale currently in Hong Kong, and uh, it still hasn't been released yet. I'm Jaime Rivera, definitely happy Monday, and don't worry, if you hear a lot of rumors, it's because uh, we've got a ton of events coming up, so it's gonna get official very soon. This is Pocket Now Daily. The official news today begin with HP and Chromebooks, and not educational-focused Chromebooks. The company has just launched a new X360 model. It's a 14-inch computer, full-blown computer that runs Chrome OS. But uh, the thing about it is it costs nearly 700 bucks, and the whole plan here is for it to be more of your full-blown computer and not an educational-based Chromebook. Uh, I've been using the Google Pixel Book for the past weeks and uh, I don't know if that's even possible. Now let's talk about Facebook as, uh, well, the company is getting more and more into the hardware business with things that are considered bizarre, at least for me, as uh, they've just launched the new portal lineup of uh, smart displays that'll help you communicate with other people, um, sort of like what the Amazon Echo Show is, up to the point where uh, these smart displays actually work with Alexa. Um, there are two different tiers, two different specifications, I don't know how this is any better than just using a tablet that can also serve for more things and also video calls. Uh, but then again, it's Facebook, man. They're doing weird things regardless. Now let's talk about the Apple Watch Series 4 as uh, daylight saving time is ending in certain countries, not the United States just yet. And uh, users in those countries, like for example, Australia, are complaining about their watch remaining in a boot loop because apparently the watch face is not able to handle more hours than are supposed to be handled. Uh, and this is just a fun thing with Apple as uh, they get these like small little things wrong, like the alarms being able to work after a certain period of time. Or for example, in my case, this phone just uh, not notifying me, even if I've told it that I am available and not, not gone to sleep yet and stuff like that. Uh, so yeah, this is Apple. Uh, let's see when we get a fix for that. Now, for those of you in the market for a Google Pixel 3 XL, I have no idea why you would choose to buy it from scalpers now, but if you're in the market, it's available in Hong Kong for $2,000. And uh, well, there are certain publications that actually got their hands on one, publications from the United States, by the way, and uh, well, we hear specifications like the four gigs of RAM that have me scratching my head and stuff like that. Uh, Pixel event is tomorrow. We're gonna be covering it live, so stay tuned for the official stuff. Let's hope this design is fake. And finally, the hot news today have to do with OnePlus as the company has just sent out press invitations for an event happening in New York City on October 30th. It's gonna be a very Halloween event. Uh, very interesting that they chose those dates. Uh, we're definitely gonna be there covering all the event. And uh, well, we've seen all the rumors we need of the OnePlus 6T, we've seen the design, everything is nice. And actually, for those of you that are interested in participating in the event, we're actually gonna be there. You can hang out with all of us. Just follow the first link in the description. There's an option there where you could buy tickets and actually the tickets are not expensive and in previous years, they actually give you something back for that. So that's all great. You can learn more in the description again and let us know in the comments. I mean, what do you think? Are you excited for the OnePlus 6T or not? One and two, are you gonna join the event? because we would definitely love to see you there. Leave us a comment down below. Friends, again, if you want to get the news earlier, follow us on pocketnow.com. Subscribe to both our channels, English and Spanish, for more videos like this one. You can follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera, on Instagram at Jaime Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I'm Jaime Rivera. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.